going you guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is madison hill and for today's video i'm going to be doing another edition of my series cheap or cheers now for those of you who've never seen my series cheap or cheers it's where i take one product at three different price points one of which is always a celebrity endorsed or celebrity made product and i let you know which one gets my 1000 percent stamp of approval aka which one is the biggest bang for your buck now today's edition of cheaper cheers is going to be denim shorts edition personally for me when it comes to denim shorts i want to make sure i'm comfortable I want them to be soft. I also don't want them to squeeze me too much because if I do want to throw them on with a bikini top and wear them as a swimsuit cover up, I want to make sure I feel confident and comfortable because for me, really in any outfit, confidence is truly freaking key. But enough about me. Let me show you what denim shorts specifically we're going to be trying on today. So first up, our least expensive pair of denim shorts that we're trying on are from Target. They're the Universal Threads brand. They are the high rise distressed jean shorts. I went ahead and got a size four and these come in at $17. Now the next pair of shorts I'm trying on, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I am very freaking excited. I am trying on the Curve Love 90s High Rise Cut Off Shorts from Abercrombie and Fitch. Yes, you heard that correctly, Abercrombie and freaking Fitch. I have not shopped at Abercrombie since I was in middle school, but I have been seeing so many rave reviews about their shorts. I don't know if you guys know who Remy Bader is. She is a huge TikToker. She does these amazing realistic clothing hauls, and she did an Abercrombie and Fitch shorts clothing haul, and and honestly, it sold me. I was like, okay, I have got to try these Abercrombie and Fit shorts that I keep hearing about because if Remy gives them her stamp of approval, they must be good. So these are the Abercrombie and Fit shorts that we're trying on. I went ahead and got a size 26 because all the reviews said to size down and these come in at $59. Also, you guys, please note the pocket change. Do you guys remember back in the day, Abercrombie had that very iconic, you know, the two stitches like this and Hollister had the stitches that crossed. Please notice how Abercrombie has matured. Just like we've matured, Abercrombie has clearly matured and honestly I'm very into it. I am laughing though because back in the day my shirt literally couldn't say Abercrombie and Fitch big enough and now I want my label as small as possible so I'm just very appreciative that Abercrombie went ahead and just you know has updated to the solid pocket. I'm really freaking excited to try these on. And last but not least our most expensive pair of denim shorts that we're trying on today. These are also our celebrity made product. I am trying a pair of good American denim shorts party people. I went ahead and tried the good American good curved denim shorts and these cost a whopping $119. Yes, you heard that correctly and yes, it was slightly painful to spend $119 on a pair of denim shorts. You guys know Khloe Kardashian is one of the founding members of Good American and while her personal life might be, you know, a little crazy sometimes, I will say she does know how to make a good pair of jeans and honestly because I love their jeans so much, I've been wanting to try Good American shorts for a long time. I went ahead and got a size two in these. I always size down a good American. I always recommend that everyone sizes down a good American. Unless you're buying their black jeans, then go true to size because for some reason, the black jeans always run a little bit small. But yeah, I'm very excited to try these on. I'm very excited to see if these are just as good as the jeans. Okay, enough talking. I know you guys are ready for me to get to trying on the shorts. So let's go ahead and get to trying stuff on. Okay, so first up, these are the Target shorts, the Universal Threads brand, high-waisted distressed jean shorts. And honestly, you guys, they are really, really, really soft. I do have some room to breathe in here, but for denim shorts, I don't like them to be super tight, especially if I'm gonna wear them as a swimsuit cover up. I don't want anything squeezing me or making me feel uncomfortable. I wanna feel confident in my denim shorts. And honestly, these are very comfortable and I do feel pretty confident. I will say, I feel like they don't do much for my tush, which, you know, I would prefer it to amplify my best asset, if you will. Okay, I'm literally the biggest loser, but that's okay. You know what? These were a very affordable jean short, so I'm not mad about it. And I actually really like the length. I'm very comfortable. It covers my thighs. I can walk in them. I can squat in them. I can do this. I have like a lot of range of movement. I just realized I don't know when in public I'm ever gonna be going like this or needing to do this. But you know, I do love to dance. So honestly, always be prepared. And I feel like I could definitely drop it low in these shorts and nothing's gonna pop out, which we do love. I am like really impressed by how comfortable they are. All right, Target, I see what you're working with. I'm liking it so far. Let's move on to the next. Oh my gosh, you guys. I think I may or may not have just found my pair of denim shorts. Like the good American shorts are really gonna have to bring it. So these are the Abercrombie and Fit shorts. These are the Curve Love 90s High Rise Cutoffs. Say that 10 times fast. Woo, that is a mouthful. They are $59. I am just absolutely shook by these right now. I got a size 26. I still have a little room. They're very comfortable, so I could wear them as a swimsuit cover up. I feel like my butt looks. That's what we want. We want 
this accentuated. They're soft. They're a little bit thicker than the Target shorts, but not too thick where you feel like they're stiff and you can't move in them. Like I can still pick up my thighs. Honestly, I was a little concerned about the length because on the model, they looked very short. And again, I have bigger thighs, so I was a little concerned about that. But honestly, I feel like the length is kind of perfect. And especially because I am short, I'm only five feet tall. I feel like maybe it makes my legs look a little bit longer than they might actually be, which I'm very into. Honestly, soft. I mean, look, I definitely have like moved to groove. And like I said, like if I wore these with a swimsuit cover up, like still very comfortable. Wow. Abercrombie. Man, you were my go-to back in the day and I never thought that at 28 years old I would say you were my go-to now, but honestly Abercrombie and Fitch, these shorts are pretty freaking amazing and it's going to be very interesting to see how Good American holds up. Okay, so last up, these are the Good American Good Curve Denim Shorts. I got a size 2. I always size down in Good American, so I went true to size on these and honestly, it was the right move. They fit, but they are not too tight. I have room to breathe, which again, I love in denim shorts. I feel like I could definitely wear them as a swimsuit cover-up. I'm not uncomfortable. I don't feel like anything is being squeezed or pinched that I don't want squeezed or pinched. I will say they feel very short for me and my uh, thick thighs that save lives. On the model, it did say you could fold them down to make them a little bit longer, but they're sewn right here, so I feel like it looks kind of weird since they are kind of sewn up like that. I guess not that weird, but I don't know. I feel like they definitely do look better if they are rolled up, so they do feel a little little bit short for me, but we're going to push out of our comfort zone. That's okay. I will say, I feel like they make my butt look pretty great, which is a bonus. We do love that. I also don't know if I love or hate this situation, but I do like that they're longer in the back. So you definitely feel like your butt is covered. You don't feel like your bananas are hanging out, which by the way, if you don't know where your bananas are, you know that little lower part of your butt. I don't know about you all, but when I was growing up, Mama Hill's rule was we couldn't wear any shorts that showed our bananas. I have taken that with me as an adult. So I will say I appreciate that Good American is making sure my bananas are covered despite the shorts being very short in the front. I will say my bananas felt covered in all the shorts, which is A++ in my opinion. Now I will say the thickness is somewhere between the Target denim short and the Abercrombie shorts. So I feel like it's somewhere right in between. Still soft, still comfortable. I mean, I can definitely move, but I feel like it's showing quite a bit. And if I drop, yep. Oh, I knew it. If I drop it low, my bananas absolutely feel like they're hanging out, which I don't necessarily love. But yeah, overall, I will say I do like them and I'm actually liking them the more I have them on. When I first put them on and hit record, I was kind of like, oh wow, these are kind of disappointing. But actually, the more I have them on, I do think they're very flattering. I do love them. I do think they're very comfortable. I just don't know if they're worth their $119 price tag. You know, this is actually the first cheaper cheers that I don't have a clear winner in my head head as soon as I put the product on. So this is definitely going to be a hard one for me. And it's definitely going to take some thinking. Two hours later. I know what you're thinking. Madison, you don't even need the denim shorts because that towel wrap you're wearing as a skirt is honestly the look of the summer. I mean, I know. But I had to do something to hide the winning pair of denim shorts. You guys, just a real quick another recap. We tried on three pairs of denim shorts today. The least expensive was from Target, Universal Threads brand. It was $17.99. Again, I I got a size four. Middle of the road was the Curve Love 90s High Rise from Abercrombie and Fitch. These come in at $60. I got a size 26. Then our most expensive and celebrity endorsed product, Good American. I got the Good American Good Curve Denim Shorts. I got a size two. And again, those are $119. And you guys, this one was truly difficult for me because I actually didn't hate any of the pairs of denim shorts I bought. However, we still have to give one the 1000% stamp of approval. There has to be one that's just a little bit superior than the others, but I can't lie to you guys. If you bought any of these pairs of denim shorts, I really think you would be pleased. But without further ado, let's get to the one that has the 1000% stamp of approval. And that one would be drum roll, please. <laughs> Yes, you guys, I think these Abercrombie & Fitch Curve Love 90s High Rise Cut-Off Denim Shorts get the 1,000% stamp of approval. They're $59, which is significantly less expensive than the Good American Jeans. And honestly, I feel like they have the same qualities. I feel like they might be a little less soft, but I feel like they're still very comfortable. They're still very flattering. I love the length. You can dip it low. You can do whatever you need to do. You don't have to worry about your bananas hanging out. 
Honestly, you could wear them as a cover-up, you could wear them with a crop top and feel comfortable and confident. I am just such a fan of these Abercrombie denim shorts. I never thought I would say that as an adult woman. If you guys shopped at Abercrombie and Hollister when you were a teenager and in middle school, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But trust me, don't sleep on Abercrombie and Fit shorts anymore. These babies are definitely 1000% approved and definitely worth it. You guys, thank you so much for watching this denim shorts edition of my series Cheap or Cheers. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you saw a pair of denim shorts that you want to try. In case you did, I went ahead and linked all of the denim shorts down below. I know your time is precious. I don't want you to have to go try to search and do all the things to find the denim shorts. I know shopping for denim shorts feels very daunting and can be very difficult, but honestly, I do feel like all of these three pairs are pretty good. I just feel like if you're going to invest in one, definitely go for the Abercrombie and Fit. You guys, let me know what you thought about this Cheaper Cheers video down below, and if there's any other celeb products or any other product that you would like me to try. I know sometimes it's really difficult to find certain things. Just let me know what products you would like me to try down below. While you're at it, please give this video a thumbs up. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget that notification bell. For more content, make sure you guys follow me over on my Instagram and my TikTok. And of course, keep checking back on my YouTube channel for my YouTube shorts. Also, you guys, make sure you check out my merch store at houseofhill.com. And on that note, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!